to my channel. I am like a little nappy, but it is early in the morning and I just woke up. I have to take advantage of today. So for today's video, I wanted to do a review on my November BoxyCharm. I've been meaning to do some more reviews on the past ones that I've gotten, but I just haven't had time and I got this one and I feel like it was a really good boxy charm. I got a lots of good stuff. So I was like, you know what? Let me just do a review. Let me do a full face and show you guys what I got in here. So if you want to go ahead and find out, let's get started. So pretty much comes in a little box like this. And then I'm just going to go ahead and open it. So it looks pretty much like this. And then you have all your stuff inside. So this month, I do like also that you get like little previews and not everyone gets the same things. So um, some people might get like two or three things that are a little bit different and then some people get, you know, other things. So that's kind of cool because, you know, you kind of don't really know what you're going to get. Um, and then they do give little previews like coming up to like when they're going to send you the box. So that's kind of cool, you know, because they kind of keep you like excited and waiting. So I like that. Um, for this month, I got... So this is a little paper that comes inside. It gives you like a little list of everything that you got and how much everything costs. So I think that's pretty cool. Um, first thing that I got was, this is what I'm most excited about. I want to try it out. It's going to be this little palette right here. It's called Celestial Thunder and it's by Dominique Cosmetics. And this usually would cost you $35. I only paid $21 for everything in my box. So that's the steal. So it's a really pretty, ooh, that's really pretty. And then it kind of just shows you. So you have your mattes down here and then your shimmer shades up here. They're like really nice colors actually. You can see that right there. I like that you have both your shimmer shades and your mattes. So you can kind of see what you want to play around with. I honestly don't even know like what I want to do. Ah! Okay, we'll figure that out in a little bit. So this is the first thing. Second thing that we got in here are some eyelashes. I'm super excited. I haven't gotten eyelashes from them since I signed up. So super excited. These are Lily Lashes and these usually would cost you $25. $25. So it says they're really cute actually. Like super pretty these are super cute we're gonna use them today for our look next thing we got in here is going to be this so this is an antioxidant dew um it's a glow serum it is from caprice i don't really know how to say the name um i want to say it's caprice so this usually would cost you $90. Really big on skincare, so I'm excited to try it out. It is a pretty big bottle to be honest, so this is definitely gonna last you a while. So that is not bad because this is $90 and God knows I would not pay $90 myself for this. So that's the steal. Next thing that we got in here, which I am super excited is brushes so these are brushes from boxycharm actually um it's a boxycharm two-piece set so these would regularly cost you 35 dollars um and they look really nice i like that they come in a little pouch so it makes everything look like you know more fancy or whatever um and then we're gonna try to test these out today and see i am really bad at like trying new brushes because once i find the ones that i like like that's it for me i'm sticking with that so i'm gonna try to use these today i don't know for what but we're gonna try to use them okay and last but not least is going to be we also got a lipstick so that's pretty much great guys because it's pretty much giving you everything to do like a full face look only thing that we're missing is you know like our foundations and like our contouring and our eyebrow products but everything else is very nice so it's a very well packaged box this time um this is from dose of color so it is a lipstick in the shade charms and this regularly would cost you 18 dollars guys so i'm gonna go ahead and see what i can create with my boxy charm this time go ahead and stay tuned let's get started 
First thing first, so first I'm gonna go ahead and use this Capri's Glow Serum. So, you know, we can moisturize our skin before we go ahead and start with our look. Oh, let's see. Comes in a little dropper like this. Ooh, it's like very like, looks weird. But I'm just gonna go ahead and do a few drops on my face. Ooh, it smells really nice. It smells very like, minty i don't know how to explain it so we're just gonna go ahead and place that oh and it's very watery so honestly i feel like i put too much so very very watery it definitely does not feel like you have that much on but when you put it on it actually comes out being like a lot so really a little bit of this goes a long way so like don't put that much like i did because you're gonna be wasting product and that's $90. So like, you don't need to. Okay. Nice or whatever. Okay, so we're gonna go into our face first. I'm gonna go ahead and go in with my favorite foundation, which is gonna be the Maybelline Super Stay Foundation. And I am in the shade 128 Warm Nude. Let's go ahead and try our little boxy charm brush. I'm just gonna go ahead and apply some foundation. I'm, I'm like scared. I never do my foundation with brushes. So I'm kind of like, <gasps> but. I really want to try these out and see how good they are. So we shall see. Well, they are very soft. So definitely not lying when it comes to that. But it's blending really nicely. I don't know so I'm just gonna go ahead and go in with my beauty blender which is what I usually use and see if that makes like much of a difference because I don't really like how that came out okay so now that we have our foundation down and well applied I'm gonna go ahead and go in with my LA girl Pro Conceal, and this is in the shade Porcelain. I'm just gonna go ahead and go in with that. Conceal my bags, cause they are so horrible. Now I'm just gonna use my sponge and go ahead and blend that out. Okay, now that we have our concealer down, I'm gonna go ahead and set that. I'm gonna use my air spun powder and this is in the shade translucent. I'm gonna go ahead and go with my angled brush. This is from Real Techniques. Um, super good. You can also set it with the beauty blender, but honestly, I just really, really like how this brush sets it. I feel like it really gets in like every little crease, every little arruga that you have. So super, super nice. Okay, now that we have our under eye set and we look a little funny, we're gonna go ahead and set our whole face. For that, I like to use my Maybelline Fit Me powder and I am in the shade 130 Buff Beige. Um, so it is a matte powder. They also have one that's like a dewy finish. You can use whichever one you like. I like matte myself. So I'm gonna go ahead and set my face. Now that I have my whole face set and we look a little pale, I'm gonna go ahead and bronze up my face and I'm gonna use my Wet n Wild Mega Glow Contouring Palette. This is my all time favorite. I always use this, I love it. So we're just gonna go ahead and bronze up my face a little bit. So now I'm gonna go ahead and cut that a little bit. So I'm gonna use the lighter shade on the palette and just go underneath my cheekbones. And just let that bake for a little bit. So now I'm just gonna go and add some blush.
I just feel like this blush is really cute. Like it has such a natural flush of color to your face. Um, I also like to mix it with this one, which is the LA Color Show It Off Blush and Highlight Palette that I always use. And I always go in with this shade right here. Okay, so now that we have that done, I'm gonna go ahead and move on to my eyebrows. Go in with, with my Morphe eyebrow pencil. And then I also like to go in with this um, brow mascara that I always use. So first, I just always start off by brushing my eyebrows out. So I always start out with my brow mascara and brush through my eyebrows. And then through there, I just go ahead and go in with my Morphe eyebrow pencil and just brush everything out. You see, it like makes such a difference. Like. It fills them in so nicely, but very natural. Then I like to go in with this little baby right here. This I actually got in one of my past boxy charms, and I've loved it ever since. It's by Billion Dollar Brows, and it's called the Microblading Effect. And it's pretty much an eyebrow pencil, but it has like the little ridges. If you guys can see that, so it gives like that feathered look, especially like in this areas right here is where I like to use it. Super cool. Now that we have our eyebrows done in our face, we're gonna move on to the eyes. So here's where the front starts. So I don't really know what I'm gonna be doing. I did really like these two shades right here. So I feel like it's very fallish, um, especially like to do with the really nice, pretty brown, orangey shade with the bold lip. So that one I use that maroon shade that we got right there. So I think I'm gonna go ahead and go in with these two right here and use this really pretty orangey reddish shade right here to add some glitter to that. So let's go ahead and get started. So I'm gonna go ahead and go in with my Morphe M441 brush. And this is just a really nice blending brush for your crease. So I'm gonna go ahead and start off with this light shade right here, which is called Lunar Eclipse. And I'm gonna use that as my transition shade. Ooh, that is pigmented. Let's grab a little bit less of that, guys. Okay, so now that I've got that to the shade that I like, I'm gonna do the other eye and then we're gonna go ahead and keep blending. Okay, so now I'm gonna go ahead and go in with this shade right here, which is called Fireball. And we're gonna go ahead and add some glitter. really cute and I honestly don't want to add a lot I just want to do a little bit because I don't want it to completely turn into like a full maroon look on my eye so I'm just gonna add a little bit to the inner corner and then we're just gonna go ahead and blend it all out and I am doing this with my finger just like that so very light, nothing too, too noticeable. And then I'm gonna go ahead and go in with this shade right here, which is a darker orange and deepen that up. And this is gonna be in the shade Storm Dust.
Okay, so now that we have everything blended up here, I don't want to do liner because I want the eyelashes to really stand out. So I'm going to go ahead and apply my Louis lashes and these are in the style CEO. Okay, so now that I have my eyelashes on, this is what it looks like. We're going to go ahead and complete the face look. So I'm just going to go ahead and brush off this powder that I was baking here. So I'm going to go ahead and add some highlighter. I'm going to go ahead and use my LA Colors palette and go into this shade right here, which is a really pretty champagne color. And we're going to go ahead and add that. Isn't that like so pretty? Look at that. Mm. So now that we have that highlighted, I'm gonna go ahead and go back into the same palette. And we're gonna bring some of that shade down to our lash line. I'm gonna go in into the same shade right here, which is the Lunar Eclipse. And we're gonna add that to our lash line. Just like that. And I'm gonna take the darker shade right here, which is called Storm Dust, and add a little bit of a darker shade on the corner just to blend everything together. I gotta go to Walmart after this, and they're gonna look at me like, girl, it is 9.30 in the morning, and you have a full face glam. And I'm gonna be like, Sure do. All right. So now I'm gonna go ahead and go in with our lips. So for lips, we're gonna do our Dose of Colors lipstick that we got in our box. And this is in the shade Charm. So we're gonna try this shade out. Let's, it comes in a little package like this. And I hate when the lipstick smells like lipstick, if that makes sense. All right guys, well this is pretty much what the lipstick looks like. So this is the finished look. So yeah, guys, this is pretty much the finished look. So I hope you guys liked it. I feel like the products and the BoxyCharm for this month were super, super, super good. As you can see, I was able to get a cute ass full face look with almost everything. So I would definitely, definitely recommend if you don't have BoxyCharm yet, go ahead and get it. It is definitely worth it, especially if you love trying new makeup products every month. We'll definitely keep using these products. Definitely super, super good. Go ahead and check them out. I hope you guys like the look. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And bye!